Toom Finance, My Finance, and Market XYZ have all teamed up to bring you a very unique opportunity to use your Toom and your T share as collateral for the first time ever. This will allow you to get the My Stablecoin and do whatever it is you please to do. This video will walk you through that process. So start off on market.xyz, that'll bring you over to this website right here. You can either enter market up top and then switch to the phantom chain, or you could scroll down and just launch market on phantom, which we'll do right now. When you do this, do make sure that you are connected with your wallet through MetaMask, as you can see over here, and we are on the phantom chain. Now, Tomb is the very first on the phantom chain for market XYZ, so it's the only pool you'll see. You can click anywhere in this box to open up the next screen. When you are here, you will see pool statistics, total supply, total borrow, liquidity, pool utilization. Below that, a borrow limit from which you exceed, you do run the risk of being liquidated, so you do need to keep that in mind. Below that, we have two windows, supply and borrow. All right, currently we are supplying nothing and we are borrowing nothing. We will go through that process in just a minute. Below all of that, you can see some pool statistics down here, as well as charts for Tomb, My, and T-Share. Now let's take a look at the wallet real quick. We want to show that we are starting with no My right here, and we will end the process with My. One very important thing we want to mention over here is the LTV. If you hover over LTV on any of these assets, you will get an explanation of what it is. It is the loan to value ratio. What it means is whatever you put in as collateral, you will be able to get back that amount to use it as my. So for example, if you were to put in 100 tomb at $1.93, so it would be $193 worth of tomb, you will be able to use 65% of that as my, which is about $125, $126. One other thing to keep in mind is the borrow limit is currently set at 0.05 ETH at least, at a minimum. Now this is currently in beta mode, so be aware that you will need to withdraw or at least borrow about a minimum of $200 when Ethereum is sitting at $4,000. Now let's get right into the process. For this video, we are gonna be adding Tomb and we are gonna be borrowing my. So, all you have to do is click anywhere on Tomb. You'll be greeted with a small dialog box that says supply and withdraw. Then we have our max amount if we want, or we can enter the amount as we please. We're gonna enter 300 Tomb. Now 300 Tomb, we can see the supply balance is going to go from zero to 300. Supply APY is at zero. The borrow limit is going to go from 0 to 378, and the debt balance is currently at 0. So we're going to confirm in the dialog box, and then we're going to have to confirm again in MetaMask. Now, if MetaMask opens a window where it's asking you to sign in, simply ignore it and click on your actual MetaMask. You should have a notification on that. This is the transaction we're looking for, phantom.market.xyz, and we're going to confirm that transaction. Now, this will take roughly 10 seconds, so it's very, very, very quick. Uh, you do always have the option to speed it up, though I feel that that is unnecessary. It's already done. We can see our balance has increased to about $580, 300 tomb, and we are ticked under collateral. Now, the beauty is we can keep our tomb. We don't have to sell it and we can get my in return and then use that however we please, potentially to build more LP. So we're gonna click on my over here and we're gonna get another dialog box. It's gonna have us either borrow or repay. So since we haven't borrowed anything yet, we don't have nothing to repay. So we wanna borrow, uh, let's say $220. That should cover the minimum 0.05 ethereum value at the current moment the borrow apr is 6.74 the borrow limit total is 377.25 and our debt balance will be 215.76 we're going to confirm that 
Once again, if you get this window where it's asking you to sign in, simply ignore that. Come over to your MetaMask in the actual browser. It should have a notification on it. This is the transaction we're looking for, phantom.market.xyz. We're gonna confirm that transaction. Now again, we'll wait a few seconds. We'll allow this to finish the transaction. And then we wanna be able to look into our wallet and see that we have my. So we can see that that's already done over here. We're gonna open our wallet up. We're gonna click over to assets and we're gonna see this populate once the transaction is fully complete. As you can see, we now have 220 my, which was the amount that we asked to borrow in the first place. Now this 220 my, you could go and do whatever it is you, you please to do. The beauty of this is you do not have to sell or liquidate your tomb or your T-share holdings. You could simply come over here and you can get some cash to go do whatever it is you please and maintain your tomb. Now that the process is complete and you do have my in your wallet, you can see that the borrow limit bar up top over here has populated. So if you hover anywhere over the line, you'll be able to see you're using 57.2% of your 377.24 borrow limit. You wanna keep this in mind. You don't wanna let it get too far up to the top. So now you can see how you can use your tomb and how you can use your T-share as collateral without the need of selling them in order to get some MAI in return and do whatever you want to do with that MAI. That will wrap it up for this tutorial. Do head on over to Market XYZ, check it out for yourself and enjoy using your T-share and your tomb as collateral for the first time ever.